Yo! Today we're gonna go over how to record gameplay while using the PlayStation Party Chat with the Elgato chat link. So let's get into it. Okay, first things first, we're gonna be using the Elgato chat link cable pictured here. So I know there are third party alternatives. I'm not sure if those work, but in this video specifically, we will be using the Elgato chat link cable. Just a disclaimer, when you're using your gaming headset with the Elgato chat link, your party chat will be able to hear your microphone audio, but your microphone audio is not recording onto the gameplay audio when you're either recording in OBS Studio or streaming to Twitch or YouTube. You need a separate microphone that will be plugged into your streaming computer to be used for your voice audio. It doesn't work without that. Okay, so to get this all set up, we're gonna take our chat link cable and the long end that we have here, we're gonna be plugging that directly into the HD60S Plus. This also works with the HD60X. Um, just remember, do not use the HD60S without the Plus. Next, we're gonna connect it to our controller. So you're gonna see on the opposite end of the cable, it's got kind of a Y cable. So we'll plug this end into our controller and it conveniently has an open 3.5 millimeter female cable uh, to plug in your gaming headset. So we're gonna take our headset and we're gonna plug that into the final open slot that's on the chat link cable here. So this is how to properly connect the chat link cable to your capture card and to your gaming headset and to your controller. Now that we got the chat link cable all set up, we're gonna go into our PlayStation settings and we're gonna make sure that all the audio is uh, routing properly. So you're gonna go to your settings menu and we're gonna go down to sound. And then in here, make sure an audio output for output to headphones is set to all audio. So that's scrolling down, going to output and headphones, make sure it's set to all audio. We're gonna go back. And then in settings one more time, we're gonna go to sound. And this time we're gonna go to microphone. And this is where you can test out the mic on your headset to make sure that it's working here. And you see that I've got audio. So now we've made sure that all of our settings are correct in PlayStation. Next, we're gonna make sure we have the Elgato device utility. So we're gonna to go to elgato.com. And once we're in here in our browser, we're gonna choose downloads at the top right. And if you scroll down, it should be the first option here. So capture device utility. We're gonna download this for either PC or Mac. If this window comes up, you can just choose, go continue to download. You don't have to enter in any information. And then the installer will download and you can just open it up and install. So now that we have the capture utility downloaded, we're gonna open it up. We're gonna click on the cog wheel at the top right. And then we're gonna make sure our audio input is set to analog audio. So it should be set to HDMI, change it to analog audio. Once you have this set to analog audio, you can hit okay at the bottom and you can close this window out. Now we can open up OBS and you will now notice that your game audio is showing in the audio mixer in OBS. For your speaking audio, make sure you have a separate USB microphone plugged into your streaming computer. As a reminder, you will need this so people can hear your speaking audio as it will not come through your gaming headset. In OBS Studio, we're gonna click the plus sign and underneath sources. We're gonna move to audio input capture and we're gonna add our USB microphone as a device. So click OK and then choose your USB microphone from the drop down. Ours is the blue snowball. Once you've selected that, hit OK. And now you have your speaking microphone added to your OBS. You will now be able to stream or record video with your party chat and also have a separate audio for your speaking microphone. All right. So now you should successfully have all of your audio going through your gaming headset into your chat link cable and into your OBS studio. You will also have a second USB microphone set up on your streaming device so people can hear your talking audio. And now you can either stream to YouTube or Twitch or record content for YouTube later on.